A few photos are being shared on social media platforms with the claim that they show the difference between the prison cells of V.D. Savarkar, M.K. Gandhi and Jawaharlal Nehru. The accompanying post claims that Gandhi and Nehru got VIP facilities, while Savarkar did not. The photo connected to Savarkar shows his cell at the cellular jail in Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Savarkar was moved to this jail for attempting an escape and was sentenced to 50 years or two life terms in prison. He was there from 1911 to 1921. Savarkar wrote in his book that he was sent to Ratnagiri in 1921 and then to the Yarawada jail in 1923. He was released in 1924. This information is confirmed in a Rajya Sabha TV website article and in a Lok Sabha document. As for the Nehru photo, the room shown is where Nehru was kept in the Ahmednagar Fort prison. This room can also be seen in a video taken at the Ahmednagar Fort. He was in the Ahmednagar Fort prison only between 9th August 1942 and 15 June 1945. The Nehru portal states that Jawaharlal Nehru was imprisoned nine times during the freedom struggle and was in jail for 3,259 days. He was kept in various prison cells, not just this one. As for Gandhi, the photo in the post was taken at the Aga Khan Palace. Gandhi was kept there between 1942 and 1944 in connection with the Quit India movement. Details of the places where Gandhi was imprisoned at different times is available online. While the three pictures do show where the three freedom fighters were imprisoned, the comparison is misleading as Savarkar was moved to the cellular jail for attempting an escape. Nehru's and Gandhi's sentences for the corresponding photos are different as they were only arrested in connection with the Quit India movement. Apart from Gandhi and Nehru, leaders like Maulana Abul Kalam Azad, Sardar Patel and others were kept in similar jails. As the comparison of prison cells related to Savarkar, Gandhi and Nehru is unjustified, this post is misleading. When you come across a piece of news that seems too ridiculous to be true, don't leave things to doubt. Run searches on Google and Yandex and weigh out the true and false of the situation for yourself by looking at the facts. But first of all, before you hit that forward button, pause.